Four. Hello, uh, this is Pirate Channel from St. Road School. I hope everyone enjoys the show. Welcome back to your favorite segment, sports. Starting off with sports injuries, Tua Tagovailoa is out for like three weeks with a treatable no rib one injury. No really knows. He's made of glass. He's been injured the past two seasons. He's out for a little while. He, he, he's doing two of things. Benchmark Anywho, fantasy. another injury news: Ohio State star quarterback C.J. Stroud was benched this past in this past weekend's victory against Akron with a shoulder injury. So, uh, hope he gets better. Uh, in the NFL scores, we got some fun games. Uh, the the reigning Super Bowl losers, the Kansas City Chiefs. Just lost to the LA Chargers, 30 to 24. Pretty big upset. Uh, next up, the Detroit Lions lost in a walk-off 66-yard field goal. NFL record. NFL record by Justin Tucker to lose to the Baltimore Ravens, 19 to 17. That's the most Detroit way possible. It, it to really lose. is. It's bad. Anywho, going into the Sunday night football game. We had the Green Bay Packers versus the San Francisco 49ers. And the Packers won by two points. On, it was a very close game. Good job by the Packers. Good job by the 49ers. And our last fun game of the week, the Los Angeles Rams beat the Tampa Bay Buccaneers 34-24 to with new star quarterback Matthew Stafford putting up big boy stats. That's all for the NFL. Matthew's going to take you away with college. Going to college sports, um, in the Shamrock Series, the Notre Dame Fighting Irish, my favorite team, beat out Wisconsin 41-13, to scoring 31 points in the fourth quarter. They had two pick sixes and, and a kickoff return. Can you believe that, man? Their defense had more touchdowns than Wisconsin's offense. That's embarrassing. That's very... Clemson got upset by NC State 21 to 27 in double overtime. Very fun game. I watched very, the whole very, thing. Very, very entertaining. Oklahoma barely survived an upset against West Virginia 13 to 16. At home was, against West Virginia. Oklahoma's just really? overrated. And they're somehow the fourth ranked team in the country. Can you believe that, Sean? Sean can't believe it. That's that's Ar all Arkansas, for sports. No, 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 no. Oh, there's more. Game. Arkansas upset Texas A and M 20 to 10. That was big. Go, ra go Razorbacks, baby. It's crazy. Crazy. That's all for sports. I'm the better one, Matt. Grant, this um, is the worse one, Matthew. All I have to say is that the Razorbacks are still better than Ohio State. Hey, everybody. It's Nico, and I'll be interviewing Ms. Wachowski, the gym teacher. Hello. So, Ms. Wachowski, how has the school year been so far for you? It's been very well. Thank you. Do you enjoy being the school's gym teacher? I do enjoy being the school's gym teacher. What's your favorite thing to have the kids play? My favorite thing is probably still the bacon, but I think their favorite thing to do is probably ultimate football. Could you explain steal the bacon? Steal the bacon is when you have two teams. They line up on either sides of the court. Mm -hmm. There is, you can put an eraser or a bean bag or something in the middle of the court. And everybody is numbered a different number. And so you call a number, and those two people run to try and get the bacon. So whoever gets the bacon has to run back across their line before they get tacked. All right. Thank you. And that's it for Staff Spotlight. Hello. I'm Liam, your favorite reporter with World News. So a couple days ago, some archaeologists discovered human footprints that were 20,000 years old over in New Mexico. Those are some really old footprints. And then also, the Chinese military invented a underwater drone that's shaped and swims like a manta ray. That's like bioscience right there. All right, bye. Hi, I'm Grace here today with Feast Day. To today we're celebrating Our Lady of the Rosary. This Feast Day was created to honor, to honor the Blessed Virgin Mary for the protection she gives the Church in answer to the Rosary. Uh, this Feast Day commemorates the victory of the Christian forces in the Battle of Lepento on October 7, 1571. Um, this victory was attributed to the intercession of Mary. Uh, that's it for Feast Days.
everybody. I'm Ethan. <laughs> this is Elise. Hi. And this is Fun Facts. I'm Elise. <laughs> yeah, you are. Now, it's true. the first fun fact is a shrimp's head, or no, a shrimp's heart, like our hearts are like right here, are located in their head. That's crazy. Yeah, of course it is. <laughs> I didn't really know that, actually. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I knew it. But, so, you know tennis, you know, like getting out the rackets and like hit it over the little like yeah thing yeah well tennis actually used to be played with their bare hands not with the racket that would probably hurt yeah that really would hurt final fun fact of today is that hummingbirds yeah can fly forwards and backwards not just forwards that's crazy i yeah. didn't know that it's very crazy that's really fun. That's a really fun fact. <laughs> yeah. Now, I'm Ethan. This is Elise. Yep. Goodbye. Hi, I'm Reese. This is Throwbacks. This is Sean. Throwbacks are things that happen today, on this day, but not this year, and sometimes birthdays. <laughs> so I'm going to take it away. In 1959. Inhabitants of the Earth saw the dark side of the moon, or the other side. Um, today is Simon Cowell's birthday, and also Vladimir Putin's birthday, and a few other people that are not mentioned. Um, in 1849, Edgar Allan Poe tragically died from an unknown cause. In 1769, New Zealand was discovered. <laughs> and that's all for Throwback. Join us again next week for even more special surprises. <laughs> <laughs>